Thank you, bro. Thank you, guys. Sorry, bro. This way. And look at me, guys. This way. Oh boy. Here we go. Great. Thank you, guys. Thanks, guys. Come on, let's go. And this way, guys. Hey, guys, one more time. Right here we go. This way, guys. This way, buddy. He hit that half court like, <laughs> bow, yeah. bow. Can you believe that? Oh, man. Thank you. Congrats. Thank you. And we were like, we were in the trailer watching, and I was like, you know what? He should, because I kept watching it veer to the right. Yeah. Now, I don't know anything about basketball, <laughs> but it seems to me that the very next thing you should do is go to the left yeah. if it's off by the right. Yeah. Little did I know that I was completely wrong. He just backed up. I'm like, man, why is he? And the other thing too, I was like, man, why is he dribbling so much? He's giving so many seconds away to the clock. Like, I would just be throwing them. But again, I stand corrected twice. <laughs> Let's see if we can go for a thrice. Um, I wasn't sure he was gonna do it, but he stuck to his formula. See, kids, you gotta stick to your formula. You gotta believe. And he went, blue. <laughs> this is like the ultimate happy moment. Happy. Uh oh. <laughs> nice to meet you. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you guys. This will be a big thing in next year. It's big this year to go out there and see those kids. Uh, you know, sports is not for adults. Clearly, you know, some of the biggest fans are some of the youngest fans. And, uh, you know, I've been, uh, I've been able to go to the Kids' Choice Awards and to see this grow from that is uh, it's really great. And the kids are 
very excited. I mean, you get to see some of the you know, the biggest stars and athletes in the sports world right in front of them. Apollo Ono, I'd like to see, you know, him get a little slime. You know, anybody with good balance, you know, Kelly Clark, gold medalist, snowboarder. Let's see if you can do a little half pipe on some slime. Early I was dressed in a suit, but they, they said I need to dress down a little bit, so I had to go put on a sweatsuit. Okay. Hopefully I'm not dressed too down. No, you'll be fine. Okay, hopefully I'm, I'm comfortable. It's, this is remarkable. It's unbelievable, but, um, you know, I'm happy for all the kids, and Nickelodeon, Nickelodeon is doing a great thing. You know, it's definitely amazing that we have huge supports behind us, and um, receiving this award with alongside one of my favorite athletes was just such a treat for me, so I'm really honored. Well, it's good, like she said, it's unbelievable. As athletes, we respect each other um, so much, but to get awards from, from the kids, uh, for me, I'm a little older. <laughs> so to be able to get a award from the kids, uh, I mean, I'm doing something right, but um, you know, it's just cool. You know, it's cool to be here. It's always great to accept awards because nothing is expected from us, um, and so we appreciate it. You know, we just came, we're on our man's vacation right now, so we stopped in real quick to kind of, you know, to be here, you know, for this award, and I'm glad that they can kind of share this moment with me as I, as they can understand and know that dad still got a little swag, so it's cool. I just don't want to get hit with no, it. <laughs> but I want to see people get hit with it. I just don't want to give you the one. <laughs> you know, we're starting to get out, get our team back. I'm um, after losing a very important part, you know, in LeBron. Uh, but, you know, we're excited about our opportunity in Miami. We had a great four years. We had a four-year romance. And um, it's over, you know. Uh, but, you know, we move on to the next challenge. This is fun. I mean, it's been something that's been in the works for a while, and to see it come together in such a big way, it's amazing. I mean, to see, you know, Michael Strahan and Dwayne Wade and all these amazing athletes, Steph Curry, it's, it's, it's outstanding to be like, man, I love these guys. I'm a fan of these guys. And for them to kind of give back and focus on the kids and see their kids, it's a lot of fun. I mean, I've seen a couple of fumbles and, and slips out there, so that, you know, good. I don't know if they built for this field yet. They, try, they, they can handle their field, but these kids with this slime, it's a whole next level thing. This is awesome. Um, my wife, we were talking, she's been watching the show for a long time, and, and to be able to do it now with sports is pretty, pretty phenomenal. So I'm happy to be here. Uh, really cool scene out there uh, on, this, on the stage, and got to shoot a t-shirt gun, so that's a pretty much a dream come true for me. <laughs> Probably my, my teammate Clay Thompson. He's the quiet guy on the, on the roster. So uh, anytime, I'm sure if we had some slime buckets, he'd be the guy we want to get to get him out of his box a little bit. So uh, that'd be pretty fun. Yeah, yeah, man. Because you know, it's, when, you, when you get something from the fans, man, it, it keeps you motivated. You know, it keeps you energized. You want to go out there and do more and do more. Uh, it's a much you know higher level of appreciation getting it from you know the kids and the fans out there. So. I would say by far this is one of my best awards. If I get slammed, I get slammed. I, I deal with it. It's fun. It's for the kids. It's for the fans. I would love to see Dwayne Wade get slammed. Just because he just won the, the swag award. So I want him to mess his swag up a little bit. So. I grew up watching Nickelodeon. Um, to win an award from Nickelodeon means so much. Um, means so much. And First sports, you know, award show gets no better than this. It means a lot, you know, um, especially for the kids. I love kids. They're my favorite. You know, I have two boys of my own, and, you know, we make the most of the world. You know, I, I, want, I make their days brighter, and, you know, for Nickelodeon to put, put together a great event, it's the best thing, y'all. Yeah, I know they want to see me slime. I told them I'll take the jacket off. You can slime me all you want. I love the jacket, but, you know. Fun. I would say Earl, Earl Thomas, you know, me and him, we play different teams, we play on different teams, but we friends, you know, outside of football and cool guy, I wouldn't mind sliding him. Wow, this is unbelievable, man. I've been watching uh, Nickelodeon ever since I was a little kid, and, you know, to be able to get one of those, those awards, man, means the world, and just excited to be here, great opportunity. To, uh, to, to show people, you know, the journey that I took to get to this point. Let all the kids know that continue to believe in yourself and you have fun whatever you're doing, you can succeed. Well, she always, she's led by example. You know, whether it's waking up early in the morning to go to work, to provide for me and my brother, uh, just making sure she stayed on top of us, keeping us humble, keeping us out of the streets. 
know, the main streets of Washington, D.C. She did a great job, and you know, I'm grateful for her. Dwayne Wade, since he beat me in the finals that year, I would have loved to put him in the slime, but you know, it was just great to be here. I'm you know, excited that uh, you know, I got the award. And, you know, it's one of the, one of the great moments in my life so far.